tuned to this. This is a Jason Becker uh, eight note sequence. You're staying in the key of A minor slash C major. Uh, and you're just taking eight notes, doing one thing, shifting up or down your choice, but we'll do it my way first. Um, repeating the eight note cycle. All you're doing is staying within the key. So um, let's just try it. B, you're using uh, five, six, eight. Height, you're using five, seven, eight. Here is the order. Picking, alternate picking, starting on a down stroke. In fact, that's a good exercise. You can stop right there. Stop right there. And just do that. The hard part's gonna be your last note. Here's a fifth fret B is to get back to that. So then you slide from the fifth B, six B, you got six, eight, 10. Six, eight, ten, eight, six, and then you got G here, uh, nine, seven, five. All together now. You know if you're doing it right, when you do that whole bit, and your last note here is gonna be an upstroke. Where do you think we go from there? Staying within the key of A minor slash C major. So now we've got, uh, what is that? Seven, nine, 10 on both G and D. Now you're here at the, what is that? Seventh fret D string. Slide up here on the D from seven to nine. So we got uh, nine, 10, 12. And then you've got on the A, 12, 10, eight. Slide here to the A7. And that's both going to be 7, um, 7, 8, 10. On both A and high, on low E. A and low E. That should be an upstroke. Your last note here is an A. Slide down to the A on the low E string, fifth fret. So you start on an A, you end on an A. I'm getting wacky because my battery light is doing its thing. And yes, I will change it. You can also keep going that way. 